Do you want more confidence? See, without confidence and enthusiasm, you won't be able to gain the trust and credibility that it takes for a customer to buy into you. I just want you to give me three minutes and I'm gonna give you two quick steps on how to gain more confidence. My name is Cody, I wanna thank you for joining me in the morning uh, to get your, da uh, your daily dose of sales training, motivation and hope, as well as change your income and your life. There was a business executive who was deep in debt and could see no way out. Creditors were closing in on him and suppliers were demanding payment. He sat at the park with his head in his hands, wondering if he could ever see a way out of this bankruptcy. Suddenly an old man appeared and, and saw something was troubling him. After listening to the executive's woes, the old man said, I believe that I can help you. He asked his name and wrote a check and pushed it into his hand saying, take this money, meet me here in exactly one year's time and, and you can pay me back. Then he turned and disappeared quickly. The business executive saw the check and saw that it was $500,000 signed by John D. Rick Rockefeller, the richest man in the world. I can erase my worries in an instant, said the executive. But instead, the executive decided to put it into an a, a, a uncashed check into a safe, just knowing that that might give him the strength to work a way out, to find a solution. See, with renewed optimism, he negotiated better deals, extended terms and payment. He closed the big sales. Within a few months, he was out of debt and making money once again. Exactly one year later, he returned to the park with the uncashed check at the agreed upon time. The old man appeared, but just as the executive was about to hand the, the check and share his success story, a nurse came running by. And I'm so glad you caught him, she cried. I hope he hasn't been bothering you. He's always escaping from the rest home and telling people he's John D. Rockefeller. She led the old man away. See, with astonishment, the executive stood there stunned. See, all year long, he had been wheeling and dealing, buying and selling, convinced that he had half a million in the bank. Suddenly he realized that it wasn't the money, real or imagined, that he turned his life around. It was the newly self-confidence self that gave him the power to achieve anything he went after. You see, confidence is knowing and demonstrating. Confidence is knowing and demonstrating. Com uh, Zig Ziglar says, confidence is going after Moby Dick in a rowboat and bringing the tartar sauce. See, the first step in getting more confidence is knowing. If you grew in knowledge of your product, in what you sell, a skill, or a person, it will produce more confidence in you than any self-help seminar. Taking time to learn and study will elevate you well above just any kind of things that you can just put together. You don't have to have, you don't have any confidence right now because you don't know. And because you don't know, you can't what? Go. Which leads to the second step in demonstrating. When I was in school, I had zero confidence because when I would go to these tests and they would have all these A, B, and C answers and I would know nothing. I would have no confidence. I wasn't excited. I wasn't motivated. I didn't know the answers. I didn't spend time studying. So when it came time to demonstrate that ability, there was no ability. <laughs> So that leads to the second step in demonstrating. See, as you demonstrate, you're going to grow in confidence. How much confidence do you think I would have had if I knew all the answers? See, that's the gift of knowing, is it gives you the confidence to go. In demonstrating, when I was in school, if I knew the answers, if you know the answers to the test, if you're in the business and you're at your job and you know the answers, then you can answer with confidence. And that leads to your client trusting you. It builds credibility because they understand it. there's conviction in your tone. Because you know. And know allows you to go and demonstrate in that ability. And I promise you, by knowing and demonstrating and continuing, it's going to give you confidence. And you're going to grow in confidence after confidence. And, and it's going to go from there. See, once you know and demonstrate, you're going to continue to grow in confidence. Thank you for joining me this morning um, I, to change your income in your life. I'm excited to meet with you again, and, I'm, uh, and I look forward to seeing you again this week.